large one here, this one here, and the other one. We put some gel on it, and then afterwards we put the, the sapphire on it. So you see it's cooling, because it's cooling, it's, you have some damp here on the on your sapphire. And you see the vessel, I don't know if you, you can see very nice of the vessel. And now we will laser it, like this. And you, you see it disappear, without blanching of the skin. I will remove the sapphire and you see it's gone. Okay? And so you have to do the, the whole region, like this one. You have to follow it. But you, you have to be, but it's some exercise that you are working through a double sapphire, there are two glasses in the front and, and, and at the other side of the, the sapphire and you will see some reflection. So you, it's, you need to be very careful that you are really spotting the vessel and that you are not spotting the vessel with the reflection of the sapphire. So when you look, you, you will see three or four points and you have really to see that the point is focused on the skin and not on another point. So that's very important. So if you are doing it like that, you see nicely the vessel is going and there is no problem. So if you are working like that, you will have no results. That's also important why the spacer has this length. When you compare it to the other spaces, when you don't use a sapphire or a cooler system, you have a longer spacer. That's the difference. So when I would not use the, the sapphire, I have to change the, the point and it will be lengthened. And if you do like that, now I use a power of 20, 22 watts. If you are not us using the sapphire, you need to, to cut your power uh, at 11. So you, are, you, you need a double power for, to have the same result. The pulse length is 100 milliseconds and the pause time is uh, 400 milliseconds. Not else use it, use it for the nose, you can use this small thing here, the device. So it's the same as the, the big sapphire, but it's a smaller one. So it's very handful, you can, you can work like, like this. So you follow your vessel and you are working like that. What I now also do is, is, is only put this on my, my hand piece and I, I, I'm sliding my hand piece over the skin and I follow my vessel. So I'm not doing that, 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 that. No, I, I'm sliding with all the system round on the skin to show how you can proceed. That's a point, that's a manner that you can work. You can also do it with the other system. If you're using your, your big sapphire, okay. You can take one point and slide on the skin. So you will follow like that the vessel. And that's an interesting point. Two systems. One way is to follow each time the vessel. The other system is to Keep it like that, and you follow your vessel like that. You will see it's very, very easy to use. I will demonstrate it. You are going like that. We will take another one here. This one, for example. Okay. What you see is that the, the vessel, it's, when you have done it, it's, it's, you would say yes, there is some, some rest uh, vessel or you, you will see it's not completely gone, but that's, that's normal because you will see that the, in a few weeks or three or four weeks, you will see some um, clearance of that, uh, uh, I mean call it debris, cell debris, that's still inside. So you, you did a coagulation of the vessel and you can see it very well here, point by point but you will have some cell debris also. So this cell debris has to be removed by the body.